Vidvis Learning is a product of Vidvis Technologies Private Limited. In this session, we would go over IP concession establishment in LTE call flow. The following is the list of widely used abbreviations in LTE EPC. The diagram shows non roaming architecture for 3GPP access. We assume that you have fair understanding of LTE EPC architecture. If not, please go over Vidvis Learning LTE EPC overview video tutorial. Let us go over. IP concession establishment, in LTE, call flow. Assume, UE attach is in progress. IP concession establishment procedure is triggered by PGW, when PGW receives, create session request from SGW, during UE attach procedure in LTE. PGW sends diameter CCR message, to PCRF, over GX interface. PGW includes important parameters such as MC, IP can type. QoS information, default EPS, QoS in the diameter CCR message. After receiving CCR message from PGW, PCRF stores the information. PCRF sends profile request message to SPR, over SP interface. The PCRF sends the profile request to the SPR, in order to receive the user's subscription related information. In the request, the PCRF provides, the subscription identifier, which is MC, and the PDN identifier, which is called station ID in the CCR message. The PCRF may request notifications, from the SPR on changes in the subscription information. SPR sends profile response to PCRF over SP interface. SPR may provide the following, for a subscriber, connecting to a specific PDN. Subscribers allowed services. Subscribed guaranteed bandwidth QoS, and a list of QCI, together with the MBR limit and, for real-time QCI, the GBR limit. After receiving profile response from SPR, the PCRF selects or generates PCC rules to be installed. The PCRF determines whether the service data flows described in the PCC rules are to be enabled or disabled. The PCRF may determine QoS per APN. The PCRF stores the selected PCC rules. PCRF sends diameter CC a message to PGW, over a GX interface. After receiving diameter CC a message from PCRF, PGW installs or activates the received PCC rules. The PGW enforces the authorized SDF, QoS, authorized APN AMBR, and enables or disables service data flow, according to the flow status of the corresponding PCC rule. The following is the list of 3GPP references. 3GPP 23.401 for LTE architecture. 3GPP 33.401 for security. 3GPP 24.301 for NAS. 3GPP 36.413 for S1 AP. 3GPP 36.423 for X2 AP. 3GPP 29.272 for S6A. 3GPP 29.274 for GTPC. 3GPP 29.281 for GTPU. 3GPP 29.212 for GX. 3GPP 32.299 for G and GZ. For upcoming videos, please subscribe to Vidvis Learning channel on YouTube. For complete set of videos on LTE EPC, please contact us at vidvislearning at gmail.com. To know more about Vidvis Technologies Private Limited, please visit our website www.vidvis.com. Thank you for watching.